The Long Dark is a survival game in early access with solid mechanics and beautiful environments. Watch me survive for a day or two. I'm Zach Scott, and this is Quick Play. What's up guys, Zach Scott here doing a quick play of the Long Dark game that is in alpha mode right now. Uh, there is currently not a story mode, but it looks like there will be one in the future. Uh, possibly episodic from what it hints right here with Season 1, Episode 1 through question mark. Uh, but for now, all that's available is a sandbox mode, which I will be doing. I'll choose th this dude survivor. And uh, Mystery Lake uh, is the option here. And of course, I'm doing a single quick play episode of this. And when it becomes a more fully developed game, maybe I'll do more episodes depending on uh, what it calls for. Uh, when there's a story mode, I might enjoy doing a full series on this. But for now, uh, we're getting the quick play experience. Uh, whoa, don't go anywhere. All right. Here I am. Mouse sens sensitivity is crazy. Uh, okay, it looks pretty cold here. Again, this is going to include a lot of my first impressions because, you know, I've never played this before. That's kind of how the, my quick play series works. I just kind of play it starting out without doing too much research. I do know it's a survival game. My friend Mac has played this. Uh, so, yes, indeed. What, what happens if I go up to a tree? Like, I, I don't really know what this game's all about. I mean, survival, what does that mean exactly? I don't even know yet. I just... Okay, I just breathed out like crazy. I must be exhausted. Is it, what is that over there? It's a bunch of rocks? Let's find out. Uh, you know, I love indie survival type games. Uh, I, you know, of course, Minecraft, Don't Starve, games like that I've played on my channel. Uh, I haven't played too many, though, and I always like the idea when I when I hear about them. I w I'm, I'm always really interested in to see what they have to bring to the table. But uh, this one, my friend Max said this game is awesome. It's very fun. She had a lot of fun with it. That looks like a wolf in the background. I would probably Mystery Lake, Western Access. Here we go. So, honestly, I don't even know if this is procedurally generated or not. Um... This is Mystery Lake. Now, it looks like I can walk across that. I don't know what I am to do. I don't know what my controls are. Let me take a look at my controls really quick. Uh, we got interact, left mouse button, throw, aim, reload. Okay, I don't even have guns, but there we go. Survival panel. Okay. Flare, lantern. Okay. So, tab. Okay, here's where a lot of stuff comes into play here. Seems to be very cold. I'm pretty. I'm basically hungry. Okay, oh, cool! It shows I've survived for 23 minutes. It's going faster than what I actually am surviving for. That's okay. I don't know for sure that I want to walk on the water unnecessarily. I swear that's a wolf over there. That looks like a freaking wolf. All right, so let's keep going here. Lake cabins. Those could be useful. We could indeed go into the, to, uh, into these cabins here, maybe. Here we go. Knock, knock. Oh, I actually do. Okay, here we go. I'm in a cabin. Uh, the frame rate is significantly higher. I'm getting full full 60 frames per second in this. Here we go, searching. I could use this. Yeah, I could. Mittens, nice. It's kind of kind of a dark game right now, especially in here. I mean. It's, Fairly realistic, I suppose. Um, oh, yeah, the frame rate is way better. A constant 60 frames. Increase hours to rest. I don't really want to rest, do I? Not yet. There is no rest for me. I'm going to be exploring. <laughs> Suddenly became a musical, huh? Now let's keep going. Uh, are there any doors on this cabin? Is it already getting nighttime? Don't tell me that. This cabin, for real, like, legitimately... Oh, there we go. There's the door. Kind of weird there's a load time between each room, but that's that's okay. A newspaper roll. Can be used as tinder. That sounds good. Searching metal container. Uh, okay. Hat. And energy bar. Nice. It is very dark in here. I don't even think I have a flashlight. I would love one, though. And now, of course, it makes me wonder, you know, if I if I look in here, what do I have? 
I have so much stuff. Holy moly. Uh, my hunger is kind of going up a little bit. I don't really know, you know, what I'm supposed to do with that info. Forge wood. Oh, hours to forge wood. No, I'm not going to spend hours forging wood. Not yet, at least. I'm probably going to regret that for sure. I don't want to forget what to do. This is kind of free mode. Colder. Thank you. It's colder. <laughs> what temperature is it outside? Well, it's it's colder. <laughs> uh, okay. Quality. Looks like this has been here a while. Well, that's for me. I'll take it. I mean, I can. I should probably bundle up. I mean, they say it's colder, but what does that exactly mean? Take that newspaper roll, I guess. I pretty much take pork and beans. Do, 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 do. I'ma do the thing. Did I hear a, a noise? Let's take a look right here. Um, start fire, forge wood equipment. How do? Okay. Wearing the boots. Mittens. I could be wearing the mittens, right? Wear. That should keep me warm, right? Quality winter coat. Warmer. Good. Uh, toke. Okay, I'm warmer now. Drink this grape soda. I am so thirsty. Need those calories in forms of pure sugar. Alright, let's... Come on. Let's go. The outdoors. Very interesting. Colder. Yeah, I, I know. I understand that it's colder than it was inside. I understand that concept of this game. Uh, let's keep going, I guess. I mean, I do apparently want to start a fire eventually. And oh, there's another cabin. There we go. It makes me wonder if I should search for something even bigger. There's got to be like a bigger room here somewhere. Lake cabins again. The dead dude. Oh my god. Frozen corpse. Pants. Wood matches. All right. Interesting. I mean, I definitely don't want to be camping out like outside when this is cold I want to be in a cabin so uh, let me take a look at my equipment really quick it's four man it's getting late um let's take a look wool socks I'm wearing those uh, I don't seem to have benefited from putting on those warm socks Go back my hunger though. What the heck, dude? I seem fine. Okay, we're gonna keep going in. I love the graphics on this. This looks fantastic. I love the art style so far. I always like this type of art style always has like a special spot. My house. I could sleep here tonight. Did I? I feel like I've been here, but this one looks empty. Let me get out of here. I don't want to like do the same thing over and over, you know. The graphics look great, honestly. And, uh, this is, these are different cabins for sure. I like how it tells me I'm warmer, as if I didn't know. What have we here? We have an orange soda. It said that right there. There's a bed. There was like a queen bed somewhere. A couple of spaces down. I need to get a good view of all of my uh, beds and stuff. Very soon. Here we go. I feel like I'm wasting time coming here. Oh, backpack, nice. Search it. That'll come in handy. Accelerant for the fire. Now, can I start a fire indoors or is that just like an outdoor only thing? What's your, what's your warmer, wool or cotton? I would think wool would be warmer, but itchier. Here we go, go back out. All right. Now I don't think. Oh, the, yeah. There's the sun over there. It seems to be going down. Maybe I can kind of run a little bit. Is there? Can I go up this hill? Like, is this? Will there be an invisible wall eventually, or is this just warmer? 
it's colder. I feel like that this is the uh, peak right there. And I do feel like the sun is going down. It makes me wonder, like, should I start a fire somewhere? And I, I don't know where. I mean, it, I would think a cabin would be perfect. If I could find, like, a cabin with a fireplace, that'd be even better. There's a cabin. It's kind of weird just being here. Um, forage for wood. You know, if I'm going to start a fire, but I, I don't feel like I need a fire if I have a cabin, but I really don't know. I mean, the cabin can't be that insulated, can it? Lone Lake Cabin. Ooh. Even creepier. Let's go in. See what this is all about. I, don't, I just don't know what to do. I could use this. Okay. Let's think about this for a second. What do we want to do? If we, if we forge for wood, what does that mean for us? The sun's going down. I gotta have action quick. Uh, how about forge wood? Hours to forge. Can I do less than one? Tools to use? None. Bonus none. Forage. So an hour goes by. And I'm assuming something happens. Alright. Tinder plug one. A long hour for sure. Honestly, don't find some place to escape this cold. Okay. Well, I guess I'll I'll stay here tonight. I don't know. I'm curious what these houses are, but I don't want to break the ice. I'm going to feel really dumb if I just shatter the ice right now. I would assume that this is completely frozen over. I have a I have a cabin over there. I'm curious what this is. Is it like a fishing hole? Condition 100%. Good. It's freezing out though probably do something oh there we go this there is this is a fire uh okay I mean do I really want to just hang out here Getting a lot of sodas that's kind of cool the scrap metals that's kind of cool as well I feel like I do not want to hang out here just saying and I feel like leather gloves would be a little more warm. I will check out what's over here really quick. Colder, I know. I feel like this is a dead end. But, I wanted to see what this was. Okay, yeah. Definitely. The, this game so far, the only real thing that it that bothers me is the frame rate doesn't seem that good and I before I even started recording I did try to adjust it down to like medium quality it's on ultra quality right now but even in medium quality uh, the frame rate was like only like 40 frames per second for me and I, I mean obviously I, I have experience with a lot of grab with a lot of games running at full 60 or more frames per second due to my computer setup so not a big deal though honestly oh my god what my calories my calories! I need all of my calories. Let's take a look here. Cold, I, I know. This probably can't be good for me. Hold on, let's go in here. Get a good 12 hours of sleep. I'm warmer. Uh, okay. Am I still cold? Survive for like three hours, that's good, right? Let's see. Yeah, why would I start a campfire indoors? You would think that these cabins would have like a stove or something. Kind of wish there was a yeah sort type food. There we go. Uh, eat. There we go. Yum yum yum. And of course I'm gonna be thirsty. Obviously, let's drink the uh, summit soda. Oh yeah, get my soda on, and I might as well drink one more soda because I'm can't super. Can't feel my hands. Oh jeez, can't feel your hands. Um, look, I don't know what to tell you, dude. Drink this. Oh my god, I can't feel your hands. Clothing.
Warm bonus. How about leather? Do I have leather gloves? Not as cold, obviously. The heck? I guess I want to have to place a bedroll there. Um, snow shelter repair. Um,. I don't have any tools. Repair amount or chance for success. Oh man, lots of repairing my items. Um, log. Okay. What happens if I just lay down? <laughs> Let's rest until like seven a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a good 12 hours of sleep or so. How am I doing? Dehydrated. What? Survived 16 hours though. Most of it was sleeping. Thirst. Oh my god, I am really hungry. Sorry, I didn't realize. Summit soda. There you go. What else is wrong with you? Alright, you're also hungry. Smashing open. There we go. There we go. Smash it open. Requires a can opener. No thanks. Oh, 12% was lost. Well, then eat it. There you go. I need to go look for food now, honestly. Alright, let's uh, hit the door out for another day. Uh, maybe I won't be running everywhere this time. I'm gonna walk over here. See, I looked at all those cabins earlier, right? So I need to go on the other side. Maybe I will run. Just for quickness. There's a freaking wolf over there or something. I'm scared. I mean, like in survival games, you should definitely. Like in real life, I would never go up to a wolf. That would be dumb. So, of course, I'm not gonna do that this game. Let's take a look over here. Going on over here. Hey guys. <laughs> Who am I talking to? Looks Party. like this has been here a while. That's okay. Looks good. If I'm hungry, I should eat it. Empty, come on. Yeah, I don't know about fires yet. Uh let's take a look. I'm still hungry, so I guess I'll eat this granola bar. Dry and crunchy. Probably be thirsty too. Do a lot of eating. I wonder if there's a way to not eat so much. Yeah. Running seems to expend my energy for sure. Maybe it's not a good idea to be running everywhere uh, when you're just starting out to survive. You know, maybe you should just kind of walk around, get a good feel of the area. Is there a wolf over here? Some sort of a creature. I don't know if I can get that close without the wolf seeing me. I'm going to keep going over here. There's another cabin, of course. And, um... Looks like there might be something over there. I try to ignore whatever that is. Sort of a... Sun's still coming up. So I got a full day ahead of me, which is good. I think. And uh, let's go check this one out. See if there's anything to eat or drink in here. I promise I will eat or drink it immediately. Similar setup. All these are kind of the same. Empty. What have we here? 
27%. Take it. I don't have a can opener yet. I wish I had one. Tuna, love it. You do not need a can opener for tuna. You cannot. Was that tuna? No, nothing in there. Okay, here we go. Um, let's eat. I'm hungry. Food and drink. Eat. Eat the tin of sardines. Man, this guy is super hungry all the time. Uh, eat. Smash the neat. Come on, dude. Twenty-one percent was lost. I'm also cold. Of course, I'm cold. I only have so much stuff, but I'm trying here. I really am. I'm, I'm going from place to place, I'm trying to find. Yeah, I know. I'm cold. I get it. This is a survival game where it's freaking cold. I hope that thing does not attack me. If that attacks me, that'll ruin my faith in antlered creatures. <laughs> I mean, I still believe in them. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> all right, let's, uh, I'm gonna walk, walk this way. I'm gonna strafe to the far right. Uh, maybe there would be an item. I don't even know, man. Um, hey, buddy. I really, I mean, if I had weapons, I could attack it, I guess. Why would I do that? A normal person wouldn't do that. A sane person, he's running. I'm freezing, of course. 98%. Why is it so cold today? Let me get in this bigger cabin. This cabin's bigger. I like that. And that guy's still running. Hey, I'm running too. I don't know why. Mystery Lake. I love the atmosphere of this game for sure. I wish the sun would come up a little higher so it'd be a little bit warmer. Um, but so far, no luck. Let's go in this cabin. See what we can do. I'm really curious about what the story mode is going to be able to offer. Let's see. Camp office. Nice. This would be a better place to stay, right? Surely, surely there's going to be something in the camp office for me. Let's go in. Let's take a look. Too cold we'll... to think. What did he say? Too cold to think? I'm not asking you to think. Oh, there we go. Uh, but yeah, let's start the fire. Tender plug two. Soon. Okay. Yeah. Wood matches. Yeah. Sure. Not. Okay. What? But that's option. Oh, I don't have fuel. I straight up don't have fuel. Oh man, let's look in these file cabinets for fuel. Probably just find some paperwork. That'll come in handy. Nice knitted wool cap. I kind of wish it was obvious, like when I when I put on a piece of clothing, is it going to be better or worse than what I had before? You know. I guess because I'm not too familiar with. Nice. Burns kerosene. Would love to have that. Yeah, eat. Requires a can opener. Okay, I'll take it and smash it open. I would love to get a can opener as soon as possible. Reclaim. I could use this. Yeah, definitely. Cloth. It's for crafting and repair. That's cool. Getting into the depths of this game now, huh? Here we go. And anything, please? Nice, antiseptic. Hitting wounds and candy bar. I'll take the, another candy bar. Yes, first aid candy. Aha, oh, dang it, just accelerate. I was hoping for fuel. Fire striker. Antiseptic. I wonder if I ever become encumbered. I can see that happening to poor old me. Do I have any fuel yet? Reclaimed wood, there we go. There we go, my fire skills are gonna be boosted. God, it takes me forever to start a fire though. It's already going, but I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just standing here. <laughs> don't do this to me. Oh, uh, what? Don't do this to me, I said, accelerant. Let's use it, start the fire. There we go. Nice. Uh, I'm warmer, officially. Food and drink. Candy bar, eat it. Thank you. Eat the candy bar. Oh, yeah. I'm getting somewhere. I'm going to save the rest until I, uh, you know, can get like... Oh, Jesus, that scared me. Because he's dead. So many dead guys around here. 
and there are candy bars on them. By so many, I mean there's like two. I can't believe everyone, no one survived in this town so far. How am I supposed to survive? I, I think that's the question the game wants you to ask. Those are in oh, good condition. There we go. This will be my nice. Getting a lot of good. Nobody needs this anymore. And yeah, no one does because he's dead. Uh, newsprint can be used as tinder. Painkillers, yeah. To help me sleep. <laughs> Is that for cooking? Uh, I guess I could search the cup cupboard, cupboard empty. As I feared. I guess I'll. Uh, I guess I will know that coming here is a good idea. I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. There's a lot more to do now. Do if I get if I just stand here, do I get warmer? Yeah, my cold. Yeah, this is going down now. So that's interesting. I've survived for 17 hours, 52 minutes. Hmm. Now what can I what can I equip? Clothing. What kind of tools do I have? Okay, not much. <laughs> uh, clothing. Basic gloves. These are way better. Cotton long underwear. Okay. I'm gonna drop these. I'm gonna wear those. Cotton socks. But when wool socks are better, right? Plus two. Plus oh that's plus three. Drop those. Wear these. Mittens. There's like three of them. Which one do I want? This one. Wow, 90. Yeah, this one's really good. Drop this. Oh, my fire's gone. Yeah, drop that one. All right. Now I'm just hungry. I mean, thirsty, thirsty. Let's move on to the next part. Let's take a look at my map here. Not available in Alpha. Darn. I was really kind of hoping that would be available in Alpha. Honestly. Alright, well, we keep moving on over here. And again, it might be too cold for me to just go out here. I need to find something even bigger and better. I think I might have to come back here. What time is it? Uh, does it tell us? 9.20. Oh, man, I've only been out here a couple hours. Oh, sh Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Is that guy a bad guy? Okay, yep. See ya. Jesus, what the hell? <laughs> that wolf was looking at me like that wolf was approaching me. Oh, but that's a door. Hold up. I didn't realize there was a door over there. What is this? Oh, I'm back outside. Is the wolf gone? Go away. Oh, come on. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> There's a wolf. What am I supposed to do? I guess I'll take a nap. <laughs> Maybe the wolf will be gone <laughs> after my nap. <laughs> That's my hope. I'm going to light up a fire. Maybe if it works. Estimated duration. Uh, same thing. Yeah, start. 30 minute fire, I guess. Yeah, 50%. Uh, let's take a two hour nap. <laughs> What's that? Maybe that wolf will be gone. There we go. Did I overdo it? Did I overdo it? Is it approximate? Colder. I'm dehydrated again. Yeah, I know I'm thirsty, but it's a freaking I can't just drink his blood. This guy's dead. I should probably get him out of the house. I don't know why I would leave him in the house. It, you would, I would think that I, that could become toxic or something. Oh my God! Is that wolf gonna? Need nice. a drink. Yeah, I need a drink too. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna go far away. You did. Thought I heard something. You did a good job, Wolf. I 
don't want anything that you have. I, need, I need, just need to get a drink somehow. I'm dehydrated. I don't know what else to do other than just, I mean, can I melt some, some snow here? What's the harvest? Item to harvest. What does this mean, harvest? Oh, oh, I get it. Snow shelter, not an alpha. Can I melt ice? I mean, I don't even know. I think that wolf is out in the prowl. The truth is, I need to find something fast. Oh, there's some red boxes over there or something. Is this a train tracks? It'd be so funny. It looks like a crashed train. It'd be so funny if, it, if I was on the train tracks and like a train came barreling through and hit me. Yeah, I'm dehydrated, obviously. I need to find some water fast, that's why I'm running. Calories, I know my calories are, could use a little bit, could use a few more calories. My condition is not so good right now. All right. So far, you know, this game has me want to keep playing, obviously. Uh, this is pretty fun thus far. Bright red train. Derailment. I don't think I can climb it, though. Okay, there we go. No, can't go in. Dehydrated, let me in. Warmer, just near the train in general. What the heck? What is the point of this? I thought I could... Oh, there we go. Oh, rifle oh, ammunition. Here. Harvest meat. Cannot use bare hands. Crap. All right, searching this. Energy bar, yes. Energy bar, yes. I would love to have something like some drinks. Beef jerky is delicious, but I'm thirsty. That'll come in handy. Yep. Darn, man. Okay, uh. So, yeah, the train crashed, left a tiny bit of items around. Let's keep going. Let's follow the train tracks. I know you're dehydrated, dude, but you're going to have to eat. Because you're hungry, too. Food and drink. Candy bar. 200, 350. Let's see this one. Here we go. 350 is a lot of calories. Let's go and eat that. doesn't seem right, though. You, know, you would think of candy bar would be more calories than beef jerky. Because beef jerky is just meat. It's pretty lean. It's... I don't know. I feel like I need to take a look at the nutritional info. Maybe it's been doused in sugar. I've seen beef jerky like that. I don't know what I see over here, but it looks interesting. I'm out in the open. I'm dehydrated. I'm cold. I don't know. I keep hearing weird sounds around me, which freak me out. Uh, so, how are you guys doing? Are you guys enjoying this game? So far, I am. Um, I'm not entirely sure what a quick play means for this because, you know, how long do I keep playing for? I mean,. Could the quick play be like hours long? <laughs> Train loading area, that's cool. Are there any, is there anything nearby that, like any structures that I could be? I don't know, 96%, still pretty good for my condition. Wait, I'm so cold, I'm up again. Yeah, you're, I hear you, you say you're so cold, but What the hell do I do? Yeah, I am so very cold. Okay.
So what happens if I start a fire out here? Will I be able to, you know... Too windy to start a fire. Come on. No wonder I'm so cold. It's so windy. Oh, hey, 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 hey. There's some civilization just when I thought I was running low. Maybe I can find a drink or a nice warm place to stay. Here we go. This is exciting. Okay, so... So far, this game is really, really interesting. Um, I'm curious to see where it can go for a story mode. Obviously, they got the main story set up. You're, you know, you I guess you crashed into some sort of weird geomagnetic thing. Logging camp. Yes. Looks like someone drove right through that. Uh, let's see what's inside these buildings. Hmm. Every building I see is dark. Right, let's search through. Hopefully I find a drink. Who keeps drinks in drawers, though? That'd be kind of weird. I'd be suspicious if they kept a drink in a drawer. Now this, a plastic container. That's where you keep drinks. I need some water. Yeah, I know, dude. You need a lot of stuff. Hey, more candy. No, no, you need to get your energy bar. I would love it if they had water. There, oh, I'm going to start drinking antiseptic. I really will. Toke. Toke it up, boys. Puff, puff, pass. Okay, nothing here. Like, literally nothing here. Um, Well, I mean, not literally. Figuratively, nothing here. <laughs> All right. And then uh, what's going to be over here? I'm going to check this, you know, horrible house. Oh, uh, what? Who knew? Fire log, cedar, firewood. Good thing I looked. Wouldn't have known without looking, huh? I'm freezing. I'm dehydrated. Let's go in this building. Frame rate becomes a full 60 once I get in here. I could use this. And yeah, you could use a lot of stuff, dude. I would love it to, for him to find some water or at least some soda or something. Everything's so dark. Jerry can. Can't feel my feet. Well, dude, I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. It's pretty, pretty bad. Oh, there we go. There we go. Talking about the orange soda, the grape soda, high fructose corn <sighs> syrup in my soda. Yeah, you're still going to be a little bit thirsty. I'm going to drink both of them, I guess. I don't know if there's any reason to space them out. All right, I am a little hungry. Uh, what's the worst quality thing we have here? There we go, these bottom three. Energy bar. Chocolate nuts, healthy stuff. I can't believe they <laughs> grouped chocolate in there. Yeah, you know, the healthy stuff, chocolate. Smash them. Still have not found a uh, can opener. Lost 35%. Dude, you are the worst at smashing things. I'm just telling you. Smash open these. Let's just eat these. Here we go. I'll keep. I'll hold onto the pork and beans for now. I mean, those have some liquid in them too. I'm cold. Let's take a look at my uh, clothing. Basic boots. Okay. Down vest. One point three. Yeah, I'd rather wear this if it comes down to it. Yeah. Shoes over what? Work boots, 0 0.5, 0 0.9, there we go. I'm so lost sometimes. Here, let's harvest. Get some cloth from here, I guess. Okay, not so bad. Obviously, part of this game, part of the aspect of this game, is that you can repair the items that you do have. Uh, which, 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 let's take a look here. Um, 
you know so I have these jeans that I'm wearing and I don't have any tools so never mind <laughs> All right, never mind. <laughs> Ignore that I was even talking. We got a lot to do, but just pretend like I wasn't even talking. That would be the best for me right now. All right, one more building over here. What do these things do? Do I light these up? Boom! Probably not a good idea. Anyway, here's another building to go search. This one is better lit than any of the other ones. Simple tools. Love it. Cedar firewood, nice. Newsprint, nice. Search the drawers, nice. Granola. My guy is definitely still freaking out a little bit. I could use some more warmth somehow. I'm guessing fire is gonna be the ultimate way to go. Flare. Someone come rescue me. I have a flare. Hope nobody needs this anymore. They don't. They're all dead, dude. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how. Oh, can opener. Yes. Finally got my can opener. Now look at this. Equipment. Food and drink. Pork and beans. Eat them. Can opener. Degraded. What? Seventy-five percent. It doesn't last forever. Come on. You're the worst. That's a decent amount of calories there. And then, yeah, I'm still confused about the clothing issue. We got some basic gloves compared to these mittens. These basic gloves are not good. So, go back. Can, can we not just repair, but can we harvest stuff from the basic gloves? Can we just start the harvest? It does take a while to do this. I know the harvest yield. Okay, that's kind of cool. Jeans. I'm not going to do the ones I'm wearing. Uh, but here, it's going to yield another cloth. Is there anything different? Scrap metal for my storm lantern. That's kind of crazy. Um, work boots. Two leather. I'm not even wearing these. That's perfect. Just a lot of stuff to harvest from these things. And then this, this does take a little bit of time, obviously. Um, It's a good way. I mean, it does take time, but it's a good way to get some extras. Must be really windy. Jeez, Louise. Uh, tool to use. Simple tools. There we go. So, the things I'm wearing, such as my quality winter repair mount, repair success. What? Really? I don't understand. I have both of those, right? What happens if I do it? Oh, you oh we can't do it with simple tools. Okay. What? A, well, what the heck do I need? I have simple tools. What are they for? If they're not to repair stuff. I don't know. Let's get a move on though. We gotta we gotta keep going on. We're back outside. It was definitely a fun excursion. Uh, but if we w really want to get anywhere, we're going to have to keep moving. Uh, the deer thing. I don't even have guns. I, I, I found bullets, but I don't have guns. I do not have a gun at all. So we're going to keep moving on. I'm doing much better, I guess, than I was before, which is definitely good. Kind of, uh, you, you know, it, it makes me want to keep playing. Uh, uh, part of me wishes I would have just done like a started like a little mini series of this, like you know, five to seven episodes. Uh, the other part of me says, "Hey, this is a great game. You like it so far? Uh, you know, great game based on what it is thus far. Uh, you know, everything seems to be pretty solid. I mean, about forty-five minutes in, and I haven't gotten too much into too much depth, but I mean, I've gotten to all the depth that's here." And now I'm kind of wondering, you know, what else could lie in store for this game? The most exciting thing about this to me is that it's going to be episodic in terms of the story. At least I hope. I mean, that's kind of what it said. And if that's true, and it does seem to be true, um, then that's going to be really fun. And I'm going to want to do a series out of the story mode. Uh, and the quick play might just suffice for what we have now. 
the clear cut. Okay, what is this? Here we go. There's a path. This place looks interesting. Let's keep going. Nice. Something's up ahead. Yeah, I gotta run uphill. That sucks. Let's really put some better trails here. What time is it? 4.54. Okay. You know, I'll, I'll end after I survive another night. If I do survive another night. I hope I do. Maybe there'll be like an unforeseen event. Like a meteor crash. That's my stomach, I hope. Not like a wolf. Could be either, I guess. Is there anything up here? If there's not, I'm going to be very sad. <laughs> that I went all the way... What is this? I feel like I could probably die here. But I'm not going to die there. Oh, no. I mean, I could, maybe, if I fell. Oh, my God. What's at the summit? I'm just freaking climbing a mountain here. I would never do this in real life unless I for sure knew there was a building up there. <laughs> but it's just a game. Or is it? So far, beautiful graphics. Nice art style, for sure. Um, really gives the player hope. When I don't know if that's you know something a player should have in this. Things look good. <laughs> He's exhausted. He's worn out. Alright, what is this? This is my death if I were to plummet. Oh, is something here? Did I see some man-made structures? Did I get a glimpse of something man-made? The forestry lookout. Oh, yeah. Now, I'm not sure how... Watch there be like nothing here. Forestry lookout. I've been to a lookout like this in Nebraska. Take the stairs. My guy has way more stamina than I have in real life. I would be so pooped by now after climbing a freaking mountain. Basically. Ah, this is one where they... There's no load time. That's interesting. Beef jerky. Looks like this has been here a while. Another can opener, that's good. Ooh, a hatchet, what do I do with that? Good for splitting wood, can be used to hack meat in a pinch. Newsprint. Seems dead. Oh, nice, I guess I, guess I can cook stuff here, which might lead to more, here? more fulfilling meals, maybe? I don't know. Flare. Antibiotics, basic wool scarf. Should probably wear it. What's that? This doesn't let me pick it up. So this is a lookout of water bottle. There we go. That's gonna be useful. Candy bar. Um. Whoa. That'll come in handy. Lo I've I've never even stumbled upon lock containers yet. So now what? I mean, I guess I would start the wood sto stove, I guess. Do I, can I cook here? I don't, let me see what happens if I start this and it works. Here we go. No, no, chance of 52%, that's going to fail. Darn it, I didn't realize it was going to fail. It was probably going to fail. I'll flip the coin. Do I have anything to even cook? It worked. Uh Oh, so food none add to fire oh there we go so I can actually add to the fire oh another hour there we go oh then you can add snow and water oh wow okay so you can cook snow melt so I do have access to snow which is kinda cool Oh wow, that takes a long time. Oh my god. Added five liters to unsafe water supply. Add to fire, there we go. And then boil water, which takes a lot of time too. Wow, that takes a lot of time. Oh, I'm hungry. 
Added, uh, okay, five liters to potable I'm water supply. Almost anything about now. Jesus, it's freaking scary as hell in here. Okay, food and water. Food and drink. Water, there we go. Uh, I can save this other stuff, but my god, beef jerky is going to be what I need to eat right now, I guess. I am pretty dehydrated. I'm also somehow, no, I'm just hungry and thirsty. Eat that. Get your calories up, my friend. Yeah, eat the candy bar. I'm dehydrated, apparently, but I do have some water. Drink. Water that's safe to drink. I would hope that you drink enough that you're no longer thirsty. There you go. You're just hungry now and you're tired. Uh, but hopefully you can go ahead and eat. Does energy bar cure both? Let me see if I... If I'm, uh, I might be a little less tired. Let's think about that. Let's do this again. Another energy bar. Mm, I can't tell if that actually solves anything. Granola bar. Eat. There you go. I can go to bed on a full stomach. I am pretty tired, honestly, but look at this. I got some water. This is freaking creepy. And then, do I have anything else to add to my wood stove? No. No more fuel. No food. Yikes. Let's go to bed, then. Uh, I want to wake up at like 7, yeah, 11 hours. Here we go. We're going to sleep for 11 hours. <laughs> I know how to do it. You survive one day, 16 hours, and 53 minutes. So this is very fun, obviously. Uh, it's not so creepy looking in here now. Radio still seems to be broken, though. And I would have to go down from wherever we are. I feel like we've explored a lot of the game. And oh, I can actually stock the first aid kit. That's pretty cool. I feel like we've explored a lot of the game and we kind of know uh, what this game in general is about. I'm really excited for story mode. So far, thus far, I really think the survival aspects are very solid. Uh, they have a very solid framework. I don't know exactly how you can die. I imagine a wolf attack. I saw stuff where you can, you know, kind of bandage yourself up, take antiseptic, antibiotics. I imagine it's pretty easy to get hurt, get an infection. Um, you know, also just the fact that I'm already dehydrated somehow. My thirst is going off the wall. I can drink another half a liter. Just drink it like this. There you go. And I imagine eventually what would happen is I would run out of everything and I would die. And uh, so now, just to kind of showcase the that in-game part, I could I could jump off the mountain maybe. I could uh, <laughs> I could uh. You know, just sleep here forever until I die. Uh, but let's, I like to jump off the mountain part. It's a little more dramatic. It kind of speaks volumes to my character's development already, where I probably have fully developed and I just gave up. <laughs> Massive internal injuries after falling. Well, there you go. There we go. Well, you know, that's a fun game, right? I think so. Let's go to the back to the main menu. And uh, so that's called The Long Dark. And uh, obviously, there's a lot more to this game that I haven't explored. Uh, I really did enjoy it, though. But I really want to wait until the full version is out to do a series on this. And then I want to do a, um, you know, I want to definitely delve into the story mode. So, guys, thanks for every like and favorite. This is a game that I definitely recommend that you try out. I think if you like survival games that you will thoroughly enjoy this. It has a very solid framework for survival and a very interesting survival mechanics so far. Very beautiful atmosphere and scenery. I know this has been a relatively long, quick play, but thank you so much for watching and come back next time for more Zack Scott games. And thank you for subscribing. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching. Check out more of my videos. And if you want to find me on your favorite social network, check the links in the description. And here's Otto. <laughs> That's Egon. Those are my cats.